Hi, I'm Sean Coakley, founding member of Caliber Biometrics, also known as the chief evangelist around here. Today, I'm gonna to talk to you about a few of the frequently asked questions that come in. And there's three in particular that I wanna talk about. The first one is, how does Caliber actually compare to other devices that are considered similar to Caliber? Secondly, how do we actually validate the accuracy of the device? And lastly, what makes Caliber different than any other wearable on the market? So let's get started. These are all great questions and Calibri is generally designed to measure all of the same biometrics that other well-known measuring platforms do. At the end of the day, we all capture the same or similar fundamental data points, which are required to display all the other biometric outcomes in the device. A few of those fundamental data points are the respiratory airflow and the concentration of oxygen and CO2. With respect to accuracy, Caliber has been tested extensively in our own labs utilizing gold standard respiratory equipment and shown to be highly accurate. In addition, we are actively working with a number of well-respected academic institutions and performance labs to objectively validate the accuracy of the device. In fact, if anyone watching this video is interested in working with us to further validate our capabilities or do research with Caliber, don't hesitate to reach out to us using the contact info in the notes below. Caliber is the first device that democratizes access to respiratory and metabolic data. By utilizing a radical new design for managing airflow, incorporating top-of-the-line medical-grade sensors and corresponding computational methods, Caliber has created a portable, lightweight, and cost-effective way to capture this data individually or at scale. Last but not least, we do not require calibration tanks we actually calibrate on the air around us, ambient air, which we'll cover in another video. We'll provide that detail in the links below.